Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel for the new subscribers. Thank you so much for being here and for the returning subscribers. Welcome back. So in today's video, we are doing a lot. How to make a uh, e-scented candles where to buy deco books from as low as 100 shillings. Yeah, so stay tuned guys. So to Tanzapa, Upper um, in town, uh, this is the junction of Latema Road and River Road. If you passed by here, there are these guys who's uh, ex-UK utensils. That's very affordable prices so i passed by here and we can buy whisker and uh, smasher going for 200 shillings each yes so make sure piti up up here then from there kuna he sent back it house junction here river road now the boys road so around leo to go up oh guys so um he sent back it house and get shop number five six shop number five six yeah it's one shop in Mishkanisha. so work on his deco books yes they are imported and buying price me from 100 shillings come on by locally i don't know how much you bought but uh, from what i've seen many people selling at ni from 500 700 shillings up to 1000 and people are still buying so guys stay tuned for the rest of the video to find out more so guys uh, here are my candles I think I'll start with four candles. Chani pungo zema odoki dogo. Nimetumia sufuri ya nyo. I don't use it for to cook. But later on tayosha and later kwa sawa. So I think I'll use four candles for now. Yeah, and let them melt. Me by easy continuum Billy at uh, Junction near the boys in Latema Road. Kuna mbaba huza hapo. Hii ndipo inaenda for 70 bob shillings. Taka kutumia hii and then I got this one. Hii liko for 60 bob shillings. So ndana kai tatoshia kwa zote ama kwa moja. So I want to use these two for the candles guys. Yeah. So there are the Chanel guys. So um, let me take out these strings. Mze kema hali. So if you have um, I'm going to add this uh, softener. I'll be using it for the fragrance. I'm putting this here. I'll move it, but for now, I'm going to lay it here. Then it's going to be mixed before I cool and put it here. Let me balance this. Okay, I'm cutting, cutting. Trying to balance. And then now I leave it to cool. Try to go to one again to let it cool. To wait for it to cool. Hi guys. So uh, I hope you know that part. Um, where I said about the combo in the boys. Um, so guys, actually, apa kuna moja, I got the girl. So, um, so what happened, there's this group in WhatsApp that um, they post products and they ship from China. So, to say meka hizi book minimum order to order from a supplier is 100 pieces. And I post kwa your group the pictures. So, mna sema kila mtu anataka ngapi so mkifikisha hiyo minimum order like 100 pieces then you start paying 
mkilipia then they is no worship to Kenya juu kwa an individuals wewe onda hizo zitabu zote and maybe you don't have place to sell them or to take them so that's what happens so hizi vitabu wenye tume join group ama wenye tulio da that first time batch moja ni 100 shillings yeah moja ni 100 shillings then so you need buying price from the supplier but not the catch bills kuna the shipping fee so um cuz no okay we will buy to na tunache mwenye ameorder shipping fee so inakuwa shipping fee kitabu ni so but so shipping fee ya one book ni 160 that adds up to 260 shillings for one book actually which is way cheaper than buying locally cuz was selling in on the 700 500 okay that's also a good business to do you're looking to do business you need to buy with 260 shillings or 500 700 and you get very nice profit for each book so yeah that what happens uh, i'll add a link to join that whatsapp group uh kwa description box i hope i remember yeah so they don't only import books ikiwa wengi and maybe you want to import things like uh, deco items kuna chain stuff yani they post a lot of things in that group na mkijazia hiyo MOQ MOQ ni minimum um, minimum quantity something you pay for it so what you pay first are uh, the the buying price kama hiyo 100 shillings then uh, when your things get in Kenya time unaenda kuzipick you pay the hiyo uh, shipping fee ama freight hiyo ndo unalipa after your things are in Kenya and you're going to pick them now you pay that later on so you don't pay the whole amount I hope that makes sense. And so the for the shipping are uh, they use I think that group wanna ship they've chosen the sea the, the shipping is done by sea so it takes around 30 to 40 days after we say we order. So the earlier messages are your list ama the MOQ the first I know you order the order is placed and now in a ship within 60 ah uh, 30 to 40 days in Kenya. I hope I'm clear on that. So uh, that's how I bought these books for 100 shillings then ukiongeza okay, hiyo shipping amount ama the freight amount na kuja 160 so 160 plus 100 ni 260 i hope that is clear so as i've said they don't only ship uh, such products in a depend on demand ya certain product na mkizaza MQ that's it um so um i got this one So uh, when you have work with your group to key order you are the first batch and you would like to get this book kuna hii shop in Dubai is uh, Bakita House hiyo ukiingia utapanda stairs just ground floor so shop 56 cuz uh, they brought in books and kama uko kwa list obviously you would buy the same price as those who were in that list so wana kuzia at a very high amount kidogo tu so at I think 340 ama 350 shillings. I can't remember exactly but ni 340 ama 360. So unaenda hapo and um, yeah shop 56 Bakita House. Kingi hapo unaenda mwisho kabisa on your left. Yeah on your left. Unapata shop kubwa iko hapo shop 56 ni kubwa that's why 56. Na unasema unataka deco books and they show you what they have. Na moja ni 350 I think 340 if I'm not wrong cuz if you buy from other places you know your 500 700 1000 actually people are still buying so guys I hope now you know in case you want to buy products kama hizi so I got here I got three of them so nilipenda uh, hii then the other one so actually ile ko imefungwa nisho let me show you sik funga the other two I got I wanted to funga na nyinyi so that I show you how you they come like this kiwezi ini Tom Ford so Tom Ford na hii imeandikwa Kim Folk okay I love this because of the nude colors and stuff and black and now this one I love it too yeah imeandikwa deco yeah so I uh, acha ni funge mmoja with you guys and let's see how we do it yeah so uh, ukitaka kufunga um so this is how the book looks like 
kunahi part eh uta uh, you peel it off so mtu ni kaatu ku cover book how we used to be to do it no no so this this part and then up and we shape like that so okay ka hivo up e line to na form was in the fair shape then we come here to the sides we form to easy shapes too as an easy line as a fold so that side we can make up and now we have this one like that and have a kuna hi line I fold kwanza and now to put the half up and then give it to Abba. It's still that hard. And then give it to Abba. Then we will come back to Abba. Then this part, we peel off this sticker. And we will cut it in a sticker. So we will make sure this part is not only half a jew. We will then now come in. And we will cut it. Yeah. And there you have it, guys. So it's very simple. We set. Yeah, it's good to have So yes, so let's continue. So guys, um, but after the best I'm going to shoot here part, and this is the best I could find. Love, don't mind this. He had a small accident in the morning. But yeah, so ignore this. But I'm good. So, I want to quick a he detergent hack the detergent is soft enough so uh, you can also use it for when maybe cleaning and spray fabric kama cutting so me kama jukidogo hapa kama cutting pia kutoa manguo so that um kuna how inanukia vizuri yeah so Let me mix it up, kitogo. Yeah, so guys, also comment what you use. Um, yes, um, before investing, buying uh, a little of this, this is a spray for cutting, so this is some some stuff. You can, can you make it? You can do this, it also works, and you know, make sure however you look as fresh as possible. So, I'm going to cut it, I'm going to cut it, that's how I'm going Guys, did you remember to watch video for I made this flower, flower, flower vase sometime last year? So, mm -hmm. actually, I can spray like the logo. If you are cleaning, come after cleaning, actually you can like from the nail you and then you are looking at that. They say this is the best I'm going to be fat. Yeah. So I hope guys in my next year, so this is the best I'm going to be fat. Set camera yangu. So yeah, guys. And actually I'm going to be very sana. And it's a hack to keep your house, your home smelling nice. Your aqua bathroom when cleaning. My mix to no magic. Yeah, then I spray maybe aqua curtains. So let me try and spray aqua curtains here. Yeah. So my 
my candle isha kauka actually you sp- you take long kauka you can put it kwa fridge then it turn in haraka so that's how it looks and then nokia zuri so i'm going to cut the extra string so that's how it looks like So you can also use essential oils for the scent. Yeah, so let me try and set up here and get to me the tabu and the candle and see how everything will look. So I've tried to do a little setup with the books. Na maua. Nimeto for you with mine juu it's ndefu kidogo so I actually think I need a tray kwanza hizi deco hapa kwa meza and a uh, clear flower vase for this but for now i've tried to to arrange them that like that the books uh you get you know where to place it but for the purpose of this video i've arranged them like that so um nionyesha hii this is how the candle came out kuchini ni purple and uh, yeah so let me go ahead and light it And there we go guys. Ina kapoa sana. Actually you know at night to be looking very nice. And now giving the scent. Also, kama unaweza karibu na wao be careful. Siamke upate kuna choma. Si kutita tena ngo haizi choma anything. Yeah, and that's how it looks like. So guys, I hope you really learned a lot in this video. Making a homemade scented candle and also making a uh, and also where to buy these deco books at very affordable prices uh, remember I'll share the link on the description box so that you can join that group and guys if you really like this video make sure to subscribe to my channel share this video comment what you think yeah so that's it guys for this video and see you on the next one